sounding off. Within the last two hours, the first of two town halls wrapped up, allowing you to weigh in on how to best take advantage of $250 million coming from the American Rescue Plan Act. That money is headed to St. Louis later this month. Brent Solomon joins us now with what is happening next. Brent. Yes, lots to do here. City leaders soon coming up with a plan. This after hearing from the community tonight, no topic off limits. People speaking their minds in hopes that those with the power to do something will hear them. In St. Louis, people are talking. These streets, they're sinking in. Because they care. And the houses are dilapidated and they need either demolition, put some money for our demolition, and the weeds are high. And want change. And I said, let's put us city back together. That's 85 year old Willie Mae James who took advantage of Mayor Tashara Jones invitation to tell the city what you want with the remaining $250 million coming to the city from the American Rescue Plan Act, also known as ARPA. I believe those are, that are closest to the problem are closest to the solution. And James had no problem giving her two cents. And we need those speed bumps. Hmm. They fly through the streets. Mm -hmm. They don't stop with a stop sign. They shoot whenever they feel like it. And I'm tired of all that crying. The mayor says she's listening. I remember a St. Louis where it was safe for our babies uh, to, to play outside without fear of gunshots ringing out in the distance. It's why this crowd handed over a list of suggestions. More police, potholes, overgrown trees, that's not all. But with this money, I hope you all find some farmers markets, grocery stores, safe, viable neighborhoods, communities in this north side. The homeless are being ran away from place to place to place, and many of these homeless people cannot get the help that they need because there's no collaboration of help for them. So if you're going to get this money, use it for the things we need. Everything counts. There you have it. City leaders will have two years to decide how to allocate all of that money and four years to spend it. The next town hall will happen next Tuesday. We'll keep you posted on that.